Um, I don't know why. Maybe I just recently saw a movie or I had read something. But I chose Loch Ness Monster as my essay assignment. And I thought, oh, 20 years later, it comes full circle. So I might as well come and join the hunt since I heard it was happening. And, yeah. It's one of the largest searches in 50 years. I mean, the last large search was in the 1970s with the sonar. And I wanted to take part because I thought it was just a brilliant opportunity and just great to be part of the legend and seeing all the people that are as enthusiastic in the search as everybody else seems to be as well. So it's great to be part of, of that whole experience. Um, and I, I've been quite lucky to tell people this. Uh, we did hear something. We heard four distinctive bloops. I don't know if that's the best way I can describe it to you. Um, we all heard it. It wasn't just me, thank goodness. It was on the speaker system. We all got a bit excited. We ran <laughs> to go make sure that the recorder was on uh, and it wasn't plugged in. And that was my fault because I tested that equipment before I came on the boat so I knew it was working so I didn't turn it on. So when we ha I know, it's classic, classic. Uh, but also we're going to be uh, using some new technology this weekend. Uh, we've got hydrophones going in uh, down to a depth of about 60 feet underwater microphones and they've been yielding some quite interesting results. There's been some noises down there which we've not been uh, able to fully understand where they're coming from and that's that's what our science vessel is out there doing right now. I believe there is something in the law um, whether or not it's a plesiosaur or from other sightings, whether it's one of the the um, baby elephants that escaped from the circus and when there was, there was a travelling circus here a few, quite a few years back. But I do think that there's got to be something that, that's fueling the, the speculation. Yeah, I, I, we're we're blown away by the uh, the attention it's getting, both in terms of volume of attention and also that reach, that spread of volume. I think pretty much every corner of the globe has got somebody somewhere in every corner of the globe is watching the webcams or or involved in this project this weekend. Yeah. 